Puck cleared out by Flyers defenseman Wyatt Wiley. Big hit on Stadnika from Nick Sealer. Taylor Hall slides it across. Flyers defenseman, it was Sealer with the contact right there. Yep, and the guys playing with him recognize that. Get to the front of the net, create some traffic, maybe a deflection along the way or a rebound opportunity. Obey Kubel turned aside by Swayman. Maybe he gets a little more room and isn't knocked down as much with some of those cross checks into the lower back. I wish that rule was in about 25 <laughs> years ago. I'm with you on that one. Van Reems dug on this number one power play unit with Frost and oh. Farabee score! What a pass! Farabee connects on the power play. 1-0 Philadelphia. Well, Jonesy was just talking about JVR, James Van Reems dug. He makes a beautiful pass. Buries it, Jonesy. Yeah, nice saucer pass right there. Rolling puck as well. And Farabee did a lot of that last season, scoring goals. And you want to put him in the area that's advantageous for you and your goaltender. A guy like Pasternak doesn't need a lot of room to create a chance. Alino able to work the puck out to the left point. Shot by Forbert to flex out of play. Of how severe we may think they are, and eventually it'll... He'd be using more of a hand motion and pushing and trying to box out. Good opportunity off that face up win by Bergeron as Pachinok got the pass from McAvoy. And now Marshall with a shot. He scores! Get into your schemes and not many guys better. The last 15, 20 years in the National Hockey League winning faceoffs and Patrice Bergeron. But look at the doggedness there of Hall. Excellent effort to get that puck over to Marchand. But that loose puck, Jonesy, as Bergeron got to it. Hall with a diving play. Looking call here on Sealer as you're talking, Coho. So when your voice comes up, the referee's arm's going up quickly, but like, like it was when I was on the ice when you were repping. <laughs> On cue, oh, another that's, penalty. That's just, that's just karma. Power play continues for the Bruins this for end, another minute. This end of there by Craig Smith. Felino made a heck of a play on the entry on that power play. The puck exploded off the stick of Smith, and Farabee was able to clear it. Here's Felino across. Smith scores! <laughs> Beautiful pass here from Felino. And this one he handles. No hesitation at all. The first one he fumbled. This one he gets back and he buries it. And the Bruins score on the power play. So Felino before he slid it across to Smith. So some new guys getting some chemistry early in the preseason for the Bruins. Yeah, they seem to have it going pretty good here, Jonesy, in the first period. Yeah, they look comfortable together. I think. Across to the right side for Carlo. And now to Bruss. Eric Holla, Nick Foligno looks to come out in front. Backhand shot stopped by Martin Jones. Smith from Foligno and Holla at 12.23 of period one. Second power play goal for the Bruins. Saved by Jones on Marshak. He's on his game. It's something he has to do a lot more consistently. Did that more two seasons ago than he did last year, but he's very capable of doing it. Shot by Cam York, handled by Jeremy Swayman. Which we're getting a look at now with Pasternak on the ice, but there's no question that Bergeron leads the way and the rest of the players follow. Here's Taylor Hall off the stick of Pasternak. Carlo keeps one up and scores! Eyes that's all yeah, you Jones has got to make here. the save. Yeah, you're gonna, you need to stop here. I don't know if that ended up redirecting. Teams have combined for three power play goals. Marshawn over to play the puck down to a minute 20. Pushed it up. Block broke the stick of Obi Kubel. Drive by Grislick. Handled by Martin Jones. Don't allow him to put his fingers in your eye socket because he might take your eyeball out. He was an extremely difficult player to play against. That sounds appetizing. Terry Murray, when I was in Washington, kept sending me out in the ice against him, and I'm like, I'm really not, I'm really not enjoying this. Why <laughs> you go out there for a while? Yeah. You enjoyed it a lot better as his teammate. Yeah, that was a great experience. 
get a game where you do have a lot of power plays like we've had so far here tonight. Not a bad thing from preseason hockey. And Thompson cutting wide. Bruins back at full strength. Shot by Sealer. Turned aside by Slayman. It's five on five. Haven't had a lot of that in this game with all the penalties, but well, with some energy here and Bruins have been spending a lot of time in their own zone. I think it was a noticeable play and if you're going to with a player like Noctavoy, you better be ready to answer the bell. Long pass up the right side. Shot by Forster is handled. Forward with it once again. Zandine blocker to side by Swayman. Forward pressured by Cal O'Reilly. Older brother of St. Louis Blues captain Ryan O'Reilly. Cal O'Reilly number 46. Shot by Mayhew. That stopped by Swayman. Just a quick little shot by Mayhew on the backhand. The timing aspect of everything. Yeah, and you can no longer kind of work your way in the training camp, right? That's all these guys come in camp in tremendous shape, but there's nothing like game shape. And these preseason games are important in the National Hockey League. I think today's player, now I think most guys you talk to, Jonesy, and most guys who want to play, you know, three, maybe four. Speaking of four, it is 4-1 Boston. Uh, take the breath with a power move from below the goal line. Got it to the front of the net and talked about Jake DeBrus being one of the key guys for the Boston Bruins. Bergeron down low off the stick of Hall. Down to three seconds on the clock. McAvoy, pass it off. Oh, Hall off the post. And the second period comes to an end. Attempting to replace David Krejci. It looks like they've got multiple options of forwards that can put the puck in the net. And this Bruins team, I don't think, is going to drop off as much as some people may have anticipated before the season gets started. Barbie has the Flyers' goal. Open the score, got the power play in the first period. York setting up. Forster, who scores! It's Farabee's second of the night. Another power play goal for Joel Farabee. It's now a 4-2 game. Boy, Cam York had a heck of a shift. And it just puts it right on a tee. And a great screen here in front of the net by James Van Riemsdyk here. Boop. Jonesy, as this puck finds the back of the net. Yeah, and a good job by JVR in retrieving the puck again. We talked about that earlier on the Flyers opening goal on the power play. And then Farabee scores again with a good one-time block. Not winding down here at TD Garden. Stabika, one final shot, loved by Sandstrom. Bruins win it 4-2.